Hi, everybody. Welcome to another 10 minute quick tip video. I'm your host, Tony, or Tech Tony, as most of you might know me. Today, what we're going to go over is how to update your roster information in the MLS system. Uh, now, your roster information is really important because this is how people are going to be able to contact you either from an auto email or looking at your uh, header and footer when you print out listings or email listings to a client, or even better yet, how your information is going to appear on a listing. So, real easy, what we're going to do is we're going to log into the MLS, whether we're a new agent or a seasoned agent, every once in a while we need to update our information or make sure our information is correct and appears correctly in the MLS. So what we're going to do first and foremost is we're going to come over towards, uh, towards the top and click on the button that says add edit. Now typically this is where we would go to add and modify a listing, but today, um, when we click on this, we're not going to just add, add, modify a listing, but underneath where it says listings, at the very bottom here says roster. And under roster, we have a box here that says quick modify agent slash office ID. Underneath that is a white box. Under, so what we're going to do is we're going to click in this box and we're now going to put in our user ID for the MLS. From here, we're now going to click on edit. Our roster information currently opens or appears. To modify this information, we're going to come over to the top left or near the top left under select form and choose change contact information. When we do that, we are now going to input the necessary information that we need to be contacted at. So things like our cell phone number, maybe our direct phone number. Maybe we have a voicemail number, which is probably the same as our cell. Here, we see that our email address does appear, but if our email address was inputted correctly or we've changed it, simply click in the email box and type in what your correct email address is. If you are working with a team or anything like that and you need to have offers reviewed at a certain email for your team, then type in what the offer email address is. Typically your email address and your offer email address are usually the same. Here we can put in our own personal website. Now with the information typed in, off to the right, we are now going to choose our preferred contact order. How we like to be contacted first, second, third, fourth. Now this is important because not only does this information appear on our header and footer, but this information will also appear on our listings. So what we need to do is make sure that we choose the choices that we have inputted in. So things like our cell number, our direct phone number, maybe our email address, things like that. With your information typed in, now all we need to do is come down below and click on where it says submit member. When we click on submit member, we have now successfully updated our roster information into the MLS. That's how easy it is to update your roster information in the MLS. If you have any questions, please feel free to give, give us a call or shoot us an email. My email is Tony, T-O-N-Y, at OC Realtors. Dot org, or give us a call at 949-586-6800 and one of our helpful staff will be able to help you. Have a great day.